guys getting ready to head to Greece for the first time ever. We got a Euro Cup game. We play uh, Prometheus and some Pacha, like three hours south of uh, Athens. But we flying to Athens. So I'm actually kind of juicing that because I love Greek food. I'm about to go crazy when I get there, man. The weather should be better than it is here for sure, too. So I'm excited. And one of my homeboys, he, uh, he played with me when I was in Astana. His name is uh, Leonidas Kasalakis. <laughs> but uh, he uh, he played for Patra, so I'm excited to see him. You know, catch up with him. He's one of my guys. He played with me two years ago when I was in uh, Kazakhstan. Real good dude, man, funny as hell. So I'm excited. Um, my teammates, on the other hand, they, they excited because we damn we stay in a hotel or casino. Motherfuckers is gambleholics. When I tell you, motherfuckers be gambling nonstop. Uh, yeah, man. So I'm off to Greece. I hit you guys when I get there. So we finally got here after a long ass day of travel that started at 9.30 in the morning. We got here at like 7. Had a short little snack and film. Now niggas about to go to practice. Okay, so what I was trying to speak to before the wind rudely interrupted is that, man, like, it's just amazing, man, how far a game can take you in life, man. So, you know, me personally coming from where I came from, you know, Detroit, Michigan, the inner city, a lot of guys don't get the opportunity to, to see the things that I've seen and to do the things that I've done, you know, from basketball. Uh, you know, like a lot of my friends who I, who I grew up with, a lot of them are in jail 
or or dead or been shot or you know selling drugs doing whatever you know what i'm saying um and for me to be where i'm at now when it was you know easy to take a different path it's amazing man you know and i'm thankful every day you know regardless of you know sometimes my my mind might might not always be in the right spot in terms of you know being appreciative of every single little moment i am thankful for everything you know god has done in my life um you know like and sometimes you just got to focus on all the good things man you know you get caught up in, in in all the things that are going wrong that you don't see the true blessings that you already have you know like with basketball for instance like you know I'm, things don't always go your way you know you might not be playing as much as you want to or you might not uh um be on the team you want to be on or or be able to play the way you feel you can play but at the set at the same time you still got so many other blessings man that that should need more than those things those things are actually minuscule in the big picture and I just, you know, I'm just thankful, man, to be able to see the things I'm seeing. Like, to be able to show you guys, you know, the GNC. And I would never even thought about it. I didn't even know what the hell a GNC was. You know what I'm saying? So to, so for me to be able to take a walk on the beach and, and just take in the beauty of that is amazing, man. And, and a blessing, um, you know from God and through basketball is it's amazing man like I said like I said before I don't know if you guys were able to hear it but my every day is what most people put on their bucket list and it's crazy to even think like that but the places I've seen is what people most people dream of seeing and I get to do it and I get to play basketball at the same time and I make back money you know good money on top of you know, playing basketball and seeing these amazing places and doing these amazing things, man. So, within anybody's life, man, you just gotta, you just gotta see, you know, you just gotta see all the all the blessings, man. You know, like you know, like I said, everything's not always gonna go right, but you gotta find those blessings in your life, man. Like, it's crazy. My mentor was telling me the other day because I was having one of those down days. Um, and he was telling me, man, like there's people who would die to have the problems you have right now. Like you think your problems are something, but there's pe there are other people out here who would die to have to have your problems as opposed to what they got going on. So you gotta look at life that way, man. You know, things aren't always as bad as they seem. You know, you're you know, regardless of things are going right or going good, man, you're always blessed. You know, that's God's job, man, to to, to love us unconditionally. So he's always gonna make sure we take care of. So um you just gotta change your perspective which is not always easy at times but it's a necessary thing to do to 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 be able to keep your happiness so um yeah man that's pretty much what i was trying to say man but the wind was just so effing crazy it didn't make any sense another thing man, that's crazy so I, I made this video i actually recorded this video not the one not this cut scene right now where i'm explaining what i was saying in another video but the other video was made weeks ago, man, and uh, today uh, that I'm doing this video is, after the, is actually the day after uh, hearing that Kobe Bryant's passing. So I just want to, you know, say rest in heaven to him and some prayers out to his family and his daughter and, you know, everybody involved in the accident. It's crazy, man. Like, again, like life is short. Life is fragile, man. It it only makes sense, man, for us to to rock out while we're here, um, live the best life you can, you know, influence others to live the best life they can, and that's another reason why I made this YouTube, man, because I just want to influence people, man, to, to to be the best version of themselves and to, and to live life the best way they possibly can and enjoy it, um, but because God knows that. There, there were times in my life where I wasn't always enjoying life and I wasn't always enjoying what was going on around me. So I just, I just pray to guys, people period, you know, who watch my channel can take, you know, something from it to, to help them guys, to help you guys, you know, have better, have a better day or a better moment or a better week, a better month, a better anything, man. So I just want you guys to take whatever you can from it, man, and just, Live the best life you can. 
And again, man, rest in peace to Kobe Bryant, man. The Mamba. Yeah, man, that's that. I'll get it to you guys later, man. Appreciate y'all tuning in as always. Stay tuned, man, because I got some good content coming. And I hope y'all appreciate it. Make sure y'all click that subscribe button. Is it down there? I think it might be down there. Click that notification bell too, man. Let y'all know when I'm dropping stuff, man. I gotta get back on my grizzle, dropping dropping things uh, more often because I haven't been I haven't been posting too many videos. I need to at least get back to like once a week. But yeah, man. Like always, I appreciate you guys coming through, checking out the channel, man. Y'all have a blessed day. Peace.